All right, so I'm about to head out to a pumpkin festival, which I am really excited about. I have some pumpkin earrings in, a shirt. I thought I'd vlog this since it's like my first ever one. There's always a huge one um, across the state. I'm really excited for it, and I can't wait, and I'm hopefully going to vlog the entire process. So, all right. to the pumpkin festival just got parked i'm probably gonna get something to eat first because i'm starving but uh let's go So why is the Pumpkin Festival important to you? Well, um, for one thing I enjoy coming here. I've uh, been coming about 21 years, I think, because um, I make pumpkin butter, mm -hmm. which is a, a good seller. Um, I just enjoy it. I enjoy the people, uh, meeting new people, um, just the whole thing all together. I've seen a lot of changes over the years. You know, things, a lot of people that I began, that when I started my business, have uh, either quit, sold, or even some had a start. The pumpkin butter is absolutely delicious. Thank you. I bought a can myself. Thank you so much. I just got out of the pumpkin festival and we stayed for about uh, an hour and 30 minutes or so, but it was an amazing time. I got some stuff, I'll go ahead and show it off. Um, so I only spent uh, like not even $30 there, not including the ticket, but it was so much fun. I got a pumpkin cheesecake, which you guys saw for $4 and it was so freaking good and some cold homemade cider, which was delicious. I got two of these cute little pumpkin gourds, which I'm going to use as room decor for $1.50 for both. So they were 75 cents each. I think they're absolutely adorable. And then I bought this candle, which is pumpkin pie crunch. And it smells so good. It's by the Taste of Country Candle Company. The lady there was so nice. She let me vlog everything. And she was like, I'd love to see like how this turns out and stuff like that. She was really supportive. And the candle is divine. I believe it was only $9, but it smells absolutely delicious. And then the final thing I got, you guys actually saw me interview the lady that made it. Give me a second. Oh no, I dropped it! I bought some pumpkin butter from Ordinary Evelyn, not so ordinary. Um, I actually interviewed e Evelyn about why she likes the pumpkin festival, which you guys saw there. Hopefully the audio turns out good. But this stuff is so good. I definitely recommend it if you are ever near a place that sells Ordinary Evelyn stuff or come to the pumpkin festival yourself. This stuff is so good. She said she's been here over like, I think 20 years. And honestly, this explains why, because this is so good. But I see people leaving. Oh, I accidentally cracked something. But we're good, we're good, okay. 
So I see people leaving, so I'm gonna go out and then I'm gonna go to Canova, which is a, like a 30 minute drive away, and look at the uh, pumpkin house, which has over 3,000 jack-o'-lanterns out. I'm already this close, so I might as well go look. I don't know if it's on my way or out of my way, but either way, I wanna go look and see what it looks like, so I'm gonna vlog when I get there, but as of right now, I'm gonna go ahead and drive off. So time to listen to Hamilton and jam out. So, they are currently getting ready right now for it, and they have some decorations out but not enough, definitely not worth the drive, but I'm sure they will have it out eventually. But anyway, I'm going to go back home and get ready for Fright Nights.